everyone, so I'm gonna be doing a what I got for Christmas 2018. Um, this is gonna like take forever to put together and edit and stuff because, well, for one, I got so much stuff, and two, there's probably about 10 more things coming in the mail that I got myself for Christmas using the money that my dad's boss got me for Christmas. So, let's just jump into this. So, first thing, which is like right here on my bed, is this baby blanket. It's pink and fluffy, and it's, here, I'll try to get you the texture. It's pink fluffy camo. My dad got it for me. And then there's this. It's um a t-shirt that my grandpa got me, but it's like big enough to be a dress on me. And then after that, I have all my makeup brushes and stuff right here, so I'm just gonna pull out what's new that like I got for Christmas. So first I got this, which is a purple mascara, which was a total accident. My parents meant to get me black because of obviously like, you know, most of the time you would wear black mascara until I opened it up and I saw purple and we're like, oh, okay, well that's interesting. And I still wore it and it still looked fine. Nobody noticed. So, and then from my mom's mom, I got the LA girl new eye Tensi intensity amplifying mascara so like that made up for it anyway so i don't have to worry about going out and getting a new one just looks like this oops here's what the bottle looks like these both feel very very premium like i love the tubes then again i'm somebody that's just like is very very random And like, I will fall in love with like random things. Sorry, I'm trying to fit back in there. And then my parents got me um, some eyeliner that just like goes on your waterline, which I'm wearing it right now. And then a few hours later, my mom's mom shows up with two more of them. And then I also got some new makeup brushes, which I'm going to pull them out right now. Okay, so this one was from my parents. Uh, it's basically a foundation brush, but I'm using it for blush because I already have the exact same brush that I used for foundation. Well, I used it for foundation. So this is the blush one. And then my mom's mom got me these, which this one came with a blush that we like glitter on the hall because of it somewhere in a trash can full of stuff that I brought up from downstairs of makeup and other stuff. Like it's a dupe of a MAC um, blush, which I think is really cool. Oh, and I got this too. It's just so um onesie that's unicorn then a highlighter br a highlighter brush which actually i just did pictures which um i'll insert here and here of this brush versus this brush doing highlighter and i was expecting this one to win because like I just have a thing for fan brushes. Like, I think they just look so cute, like, going like that. But, shockingly, this one actually applied it better. I feel like it's because, like, these ones pick up more product because of they're thicker. And, like, there's more concentration. And then there's also this one, which I feel like will be a good little contouring brush on the go, or just generally um there's one more actually 
two more over here. And no, I have not used it already. It's just the color that it is. So this came with a makeup palette, which will be also later in the video. Um, and then there's a spoolie with a brush that's for eyebrows, which I fell in love with the brush immediately. So that's everything. Wait, hold on. Let me look. Nope, that's not everything new in here. Okay. So I also got a few liquid lipsticks. I got four of them. And I also have a brand new... Oh, okay. There's a couple new things in here. My bad. There's um a new... Um, eye pencil sharpener, but I'm not going to dig that out of the bottom. So there's this, which is just a um, lip liner. And then there's these, which are mini liquid lipsticks. And now these are up for debate. But I feel like they're knockoffs or dupes of the Kylie Jenner lip kits. Like, if you ask me, they look very, very similar. Like, where have I seen these before? So, basically, this one's just like a very light golden brown, and this one's like a darker golden brown, like a more, like, cool tone, or warm tone. I can't ever keep track of which one's the good, like, the bright, and, you know, you get my point. Alright, now to get into the trash can of stuff. Okay, so this is what my new makeup brushes came in the these ones not the wet and wild one um i got a bunch of new hair clips which was pretty nice and yes these are all clear ones down the middle you just can't really see it on camera which we needed some anyway so it's really good and then these ones are my mom's because i got her the exact same ones and then there's these ones from Revlon. And I got a bunch of Bic pens because I love to write. And then there's this LA Color nail dryer, but I don't have batteries, so. And then there's this, which just has mini boxes in it because my grandma got me a bunch of stuff inside of this box. And like a couple things in like those little boxes, which I'll get into in one of the bags of stuff. Okay, and then there's these, which these are keychain lights, which, okay, there's no batteries in them, so they won't work anyway. But basically, you put batteries in them and then they light up when you press that like that and then there's a bunch of nails which you tell I did my nails today this is my better hand because my mom messed up my other one and then there's this because like I said that I wanted crafting um bling which I really honestly meant like the little rhinestones and stuff like that you put on your nails or like make custom phone cases that's what we wanted to do is i wanted to make myself a phone case but this is fine i could like cut out the little pieces of it and like try to do my best with it and then there's this lotion it's a victoria secret inspired lotion which i think is cool like but you know what though like i've smelled victoria secret stuff and like it basically smells exactly the same so it's not a huge deal. And then there's the corresponding perfumes. There's another lotion, which I love how this one looks. It's 
got black lace on it. Like, that's how the whole box looked, too, and I just fell in love with that. And this one splattered all over my face, so, like, it was meant to be. And then there's this one, which goes along with the first lotion. It smells really, really good. This one's Pink Lace, and this one's Kiss Crush. Um, I oddly like the pink, lo um, pink Lace better. Oh, okay, so this goes with this. My bad. This goes with this, and then those other two go together. I just really like this packaging, though. So I kind of feel like I go more towards the pink lace ones. And then I got an electric razor, which I already used this morning. And left hair all over my couch, but that's a gross story. Sorry. Okay, and then I got um, Taylor Swift Red because, like, I have... I used to have the CD. It got stolen off our car. It got stolen a few years ago. I still have, like, the pamphlet that's, like, limited edition. But I just didn't have the CD anymore. So, yeah. And then I got, like, a ton of nail polish. Between my parents and my cousin, that's, like, my brother, I got more than I can count so I'm just gonna throw all this all back in here so I don't lose everything and it was already overflowing just so you know like nothing new there I'll just leave that out because like you don't want to burn right now. Alright, we go cheese, everything. Okay, yeah. That's everything out of the trash can full. Alright, now on to this. So this is a bath set which i cannot wait to use a towel because of the towel i feel like it's going to be somewhat easier to wrap around my tiny body but basically it's a fluffy towel which i cannot wait to use um a hair towel a scrubby and some lotion And then my grandpa also got me um, some pants. There's two different pairs. I'm going to probably wear the gray ones tomorrow because I'm trying to save my black ones for when my 1 out of 10 things come in. It's like they're really, they seem like they're really going to fit good. And then I got a scarf and a hat from my grandma. Because obviously, like, you know, she's going to get me that kind of stuff, make sure I stay warm. Bag two. Alright. So this is a makeup bag my mom's mom got me. And there's some more stuff left we jammed into that. Okay, so there's some nail files. Another nail file, which is such a better grit. When I did my nails, I used this one. I wish I would have known how good of a grit this was. Cause, like, I didn't even touch it at that point, so. And then I did get a bunch of, like, um, nail decals. Or decals. <laughs> To do my nails with. Okay, 
there's this one is like the striped cross this is strip crossed diamond seashell and waves and then this one's just like little cutouts like stars hearts lips stuff like that and then i got some earrings from my grandma she got the wrong birth sign but that's completely okay because you know she's not able to keep track of that stuff she's getting older and I got a bunch of beautiful earrings. They just look like that. I'm wearing one of them, the one of the pairs right now because of my previous pair of earrings actually would turn my ear screen. So, and then I also got some chokers, which I really appreciated the thought. However, I tried one on earlier. I, I think it was this one. And it's way too big for my throat. But this one looks like it's smaller, so it might be a better fit. Let's find out. This one looks iridescent. Ooh. You don't see why it wouldn't be the same way, but benefit of the doubt, right? Yep, still too big. But like I said, I really appreciate the thought that I'm sure she put into it. She but she knows me pretty well and she knows like I like that kind of stuff. I was to go like this is trickery because like it looks almost as if I guess I do have a really small neck. I never really noticed that until Okay, and then these are my old earrings ones that will turn my ear screen. They are from Claire's like years and years and years ago. So I used to have my ears pierced and I let them close and I just got them repierced like two years ago. Alright, and then there's these. These are my Merry Christmas earrings that I got from Walmart as an early Christmas present. And then I asked for some hoops, and my parents obviously came through, and they got me some hoops. Which they hang down pretty decently low, which I like that. And then I asked for a new... Um, set of eyelash curlers which they just look like this which if anybody could tell me what this little piece is for that'd be awesome it's like detachable or maybe not yeah it's detachable it just looks like this I don't know what it's for. Maybe so you don't hurt your fingers? I don't know. Like that confused me when I seen that. I didn't notice it until like later in the day. And then there's this little brush that came with my nail stuff, which was actually really, really easy for like dusting off the nail filing powder some nail glue which came with my nails um some more earrings um these ones are really pretty but i think they're supposed to be like another birthstone but that's fine they're so pretty a bunch of glitter Ooh, this one's hollow I'm gonna see if you guys can see that. Hold on, let me turn it the other way. It'll be easier to see it. I'll insert a video of me playing with the glitter, like showing you guys 
like the shifts in it it's not all hollow but there are hollow pieces like actual hollow you have a iridescent i could be wrong but and then my grandma found this uh, spencer's and it is a hot topic hot topic rep necklace which I will rep Hot Topic all the time. I love Hot Topic. But for some reason, it's also a tongue twister for me. And then she also got me this beautiful, smaller type of necklace. Which, it has a fake diamond that actually looks very cute and real. And then I wore this bracelet today that she had gotten me, but it broke like fairly quickly. It's like one of the ones that you like you put the straight piece to the round piece, but the piece that like makes it like kind of stay and like be like that. Like watch, okay? It'll be like that, and I'll go like that, and. Boom. Sorry, like, it just randomly totally came completely undone on me. If I had to at least, like, try to fix it. Also, do you appreciate my efforts on trying to make these look fake, like, loobies? It was the attempt to count, right? Alright, and then there's... A couple more glitters in here. This one... Right here, does not do anything. This is more like iridescent because it only shifts like two colors. Okay, this one's hollow. Like total hollow. So I'll get those two on video later. I also got a phone charger and earbuds, which they're all the way across the room. So. I'll film that portion on my phone. And while I'm doing that, I'll show you guys those hollow bits but first let me finish putting this stuff in here so I have to go put it away after this video I know, like, this is, like, the least entertaining video of the year. Just go in there. All right, so next is two smaller things. So I got a purple notebook. It's like a pastel purple, which every 
everybody knows me knows I like pastel colors. And then I got a pastel, actually more like a vibrant blue notebook. So yeah. So now let's cut to the next clip where I show you the stuff that I got in makeup. Okay, so I have more stuff coming in the mail today. First thing was this, which I love it. Um, a lot of this was done with this. I swapped out using different palettes I just got. Um, I use my LA colors and did blue in the crease in this area and the black here. And then I have faded it out with a purple, which you can't really see it on camera because I'm using a webcam. And then um, I used the color um, I used the, um, the color Plumeria for blending everything out. And then I think I actually know I didn't use this palette for that. And then under my eyes, I used the blue from that other palette. And then I used the color Stargazer Plumeria and that blue shade. Then this and this. Okay, guys, so to add to my what I got for Christmas haul, so I'm gonna go from smallest to biggest. So, the first thing I got was this. Well, actually, this just came. It looks like this. Um, it's from that game Very Nice I play on my phone. Alright, sorry about that. My mom had to come upstairs. Um, so this is an anklet that I had gotten. It actually feels really, really good. Like, the heftiness. So, the second biggest ticket items that I got were... And these are from... This one's from Walmart. Is I got the NYX Concealer. In the shade CW00 which seems like it might be a, just a bit too dark for me, even though I had ordered the lightest shade they got. <laughs> I am very, very light. Like, I am probably as white as my, like, this part of my nail. So, like, see how dark that is for me? So, the next thing I got was from Ulta. And it is the Kiss Lush Couture Triple Push-Up Collection Lashes in Teddy. So they just look like fat. I'm very excited to wear these. I'm wear these on Saturday. And then the next thing I got I am very very excited about it is from the brand BB which is going DD on your screen but it's BB so basically it was sold to the company shoe show for $70 and then their resale price of this was $29.99, but then they had a sale and they marked it down to $9.97. So it's basically a $100 bag marked down to $10. And here it is. Hallelujah. I'm in love with it. 
Um, I'm definitely keeping it out of my dog's reach because if he's not allowed to touch it, he's not allowed to look at it. Basically, this is the string of chain that comes with it. It is very, very heavy. You can tell it's definitely good quality. And like, if I'm looking at the fabric that is interlaced with it, I mean, it kind of looks cheap, but I don't feel cheap. And if you like really, really look at it, you can tell that it's really not cheap. Because of, like you can see that it's not fraying or anything. Like I was looking at it like there's got to be a reason they marked it down. There's got to be a reason. It's got to be a reason. Like I looked the whole thing over. I'm double checking now. I just don't see a reason for it to be marked down from $100 to $10. Especially with this, because like, this is so well made. And if you are a person that don't like the chain, which I feel like for like certain events I wouldn't want the chain, you just carry it like this. But I'm going to just go ahead and throw some things that I already previously planned on throwing in here. So that would be... I'm going to throw in this little coin purse I also got from Very Dice, which holds my earbuds. That I recently got. I did plan on putting some makeup in this makeup bag, but like this is basically the size of the bag. But that's totally fine. Um, I don't really touch up while I'm out anyway, so for me that's not a huge deal. As long as it can fit that, my phone and my phone charger, I'm good. Which seemingly it will. My earbuds are in here now, so. Yeah, it's gorgeous, and I love it. I have matching shoes coming tomorrow, so 